Hello and welcome to the Super Rob. I'm Sam. I'm Matt. And today we're reacting to Logan Dagger. You ready? Yep. Now, oh, good as we've been discussing for the last for few weeks, while, we? the best heroes, the ones we love and cherish, yeah. they follow an arc. Odysseus, Dorothy, Rick, and Morty, they've all walked the same path. They've answered that the was call. And Morty. Met the mentor yes, and battled the threshold guardian. That's the cool item spot. She best not be doing dumb shit. Are you watching the show? Fuck's sake. Oh, yeah, for a while. There you got fridge. We're looking into the statements made on the tape. Connors. That's his name? Yes, ma'am. We've opened a file Kurt to look Connors into Tyrone's that. version of events. <laughs> What happens next? See, this is what the you had a problem suspended. with. I'm surprised you have no opinion. Further investigation. What? Well, not just to put it if he got arrested. Yeah, I think it's ridiculous. We've heard that song before. But I don't want to harp on about it. on these situations that weren't there before. Is that the girlfriend? Yeah. What were you doing? Is that hair different or something? There is nothing in all the worlds that will destroy us like we will. <laughs> I can't say. I haven't How seen him so long. Away? I can't <laughs> tell you. Maybe that's it. I don't know. It's always throwing me. Auntie. And when I touch someone, write someone in the right place, Stop. <laughs> I can step inside. I'm into it. I can steal them and feel them and have them all for myself. That <laughs> best turn into something interesting. Oh no, it's your breath. Have you decided what you want to do? About Roxanne? No, I don't know. I can't believe it's been eight years. I mean, I know it's objectively true, it's just... Why don't she ask him? I don't know. Did you ever see my mum wearing sunglasses? Your father was a good man, Sandy. The best. Are we meant to read... Every day. <laughs> oh, I love that. Are we meant to read anything into that? The fact they're both spacing out? They could be connected, or are they just both? Uh, something goofy. Like, oh, I'm stupid with the breast. Yeah, but she 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 takes the piss. Hey, mm. hey, I'm sorry about my dad. He's just, he's still... Tyrone, move. Oh, you my God. The door without permission, and there's nothing that I can <laughs> do. Get... I said move! No, not until you... I'm glad the other one's doing the kiss. Holy shit. I, I ain't gonna lie. I, I, I thought something was gonna happen. <laughs> it might still happen. Oh, no. That priest better not be up to no good. Oh my god, is he such a little boy? I'm worried. <laughs> Why? At the football there. <laughs> the most stereotypical football you've ever seen in your life, but don't worry about it. Oh god. Oh wait, is that a little girl? I don't know what's going on, but I'm very uncomfortable. Oh, is he a drunk driver oh. or something? Okay. Right. Oh, that's less disturbing. Worried about it, or has he actually done it? I think he's actually done it, isn't he? He better not have. <laughs> I don't know why I'm being angry. I'll be alright. I'm getting pissed off at him, and I don't know what he's done. I forget how his powers work. Did you see the feature? He, no, he sees his beer. So maybe it's like, oh, I've got a bit of a drink. Rode with him a few days when we were on tactical alert. Everyone in that damn neighborhood knew who he was. Duke said one him over somehow. He was a good man. Yeah. <laughs> well, 
house. Uh, I'd go as far as saying he me? was a uh, very chilled out guy. <laughs> <laughs> my respect. Oh, my man's out of jail. Of course he's out of fucking jail. Yeah, he should have been there in the first guy. place. Solid cop. It's a damn tragedy that he got involved with the wrong people. Yo! Get me in. There you go. There you go. Yeah, no one's ever been. Just letting this guy down one, aren't you? How's your little quest for justice feeling now, New York? You really think your inadmissible YouTube videos would keep me behind bars? Thank you. Yo. I thought he was going to dash the glass on too long. You and me ain't finished yet. And it's a pub full of cops, Whiskey. and anyone gonna step in? Nice and cold. Yeah, but it's like, do you know that uh, Falcone thing in Bat Batman Begins, where it's like, oh, I could pull out my gun and pop you in front of all these people, and I wouldn't do fuck all. Yeah. Ty's having a pretty awful day, so maybe you can yell at him another time. Can you just stay out of this? Oh, no, I don't think so. She'd get knocked oh, down. get the hell out of here. So on. This lady, that mother. Where that? Uh... No. Yo, that was cool. Oh my god. How did you? It's you. Hey, Peter. Excuse me if I don't take wellness advice from the Bone family. Screw you, Tyrone. Oh. Oh. I'll see you when you drink. <laughs> <laughs> like he you knows what to do. Throw a cloak at her head, I don't know. He, I swear he best be able to throw shit. Not just he tell him. Right now you may be wondering what is the oh, point this, of the Yes, I'm wondering what the point of this is. Why would your hero go through any of this? Hey you guys, blasted. probably safest if you step <laughs> Okay. What the? Okay. Start in the dream. Well, no, it wasn't a dream because it actually happened. They just went back. No, really no, I mean, they're like. When they pulled their dad out, they walk around like yeah. weird zombie things, and I'm dreaming. So that's what they're like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I see it every day. I see your bravery and your intelligence and your willpower. Really? I'm not saying it. <laughs> you know what I mean? You're more like your brother. That must have happened off camera. <laughs> Inspires me. Almost as much as it scares the shit out of me. <laughs> She's good though, she might be the best actress in the show. Tyrone, or actor. Teleport pool. I don't know, I said the murder was someone. Mom, I know you're here, the door was unlocked and I... Oh, maybe the guy got stuff in the fridge. I want to talk about everything. About Dad. About me. I don't know, I just... I need to... Yo! Candy. Who are you? Mr. Scarborough sends his regards. I'm gonna kill mommy in three seconds unless you come out. You know I'm not one to bluff. Three. When the rubber hits the road and that tire blows, 
too. We will ask ourselves the question at the center of all myth. One. Who are we? Go on then, what do you think? Uh, I still thought it was pretty good, but there's a whole lot of moping around in this episode. This was an interesting episode, because one of the kind of things people kind of, I guess, criticised about it is you have all the early characters, and then you, you, you kind of, there was no development, you never see him again. That priest we saw in this episode, we saw him in episode one, never saw him again. We ain't seen the girlfriend for like about three or four episodes, we ain't seen Auntie. We see, we've only seen her once and then never seen her again. So like, I, I kind of get boyfriend like, too. Uh, yeah, that's what I mean. It's like you you kind of bought all these characters. Like, I'm in my head. I'm thinking if we go into the season finale, episode ten, next next episode, and none of them feature in it, I'll be like, what the fuck's going on? Like, why would you why would you kind of bought them back for that? Um. I get the scene was about Tandy and her desperately needing something because she thinks she's lost it. I guess like all her eggs were in the dad basket and now she's had that one vision for some reason that's crushed everything for her. But I felt that scene, um, you know, the one right before the um, she was stealing something from him in the dream, wherever that was. Yeah, hope. That's how I, yeah. I thought that would have been slightly more effective if we had seen more of the boyfriend. There was a whole lot of I need you, blah blah blah, but we haven't seen much of him. We don't really know him. Mm. I take it he's a nice guy, but I have no idea. Is, is he the one? Do we think he's the one that ransacked their place? Well, he took the money and fucked off. But I guess he, he, he weren't really that invested anyway because he was a bit all over the place. Um, so maybe it was just a kind of thing to powers and stuff like that. And, you know, she kind of self-destructed, and then I guess she has to pull herself together because her mum's in trouble. Where was Ty left off? We just watched the episode, and I can't... He ran out, he ran, he ran out, because the, oh, yeah. the police showed up, he lost. Yeah, so I guess they've kind of framed him for the murder of that police officer. So, mm -hmm. whatever, but I mean, the mum and shit's completely behind him. So, that's, so he's going to be on the run. I guess something big is going to have to happen to clear their name, or they're both going to be on the run at the end of the end of the season, or whatever. My thing is, and this ain't coming from nowhere. I'm just going to lay this now, thinking maybe it works out. The majority of their villains are kind of these ethereal things. Now, I'm I'm just going to say this now, so I can be the first to jump on it. If that vision that she saw of dad, dad giving her the eye jammy, the back end, whether maybe that could have been manipulated by someone else that we ain't seen yet. Maybe. Even if it wasn't, I still... I don't think that was too big of a deal. Obviously, it's a shitty thing to see, but she's acting like that means her dad was like awful wife beater or he's knocked her mum about that's not necessarily true it might be the case but well, have well, a sit down with your mum talk about it well, find out she, she's looking at the mum with all the, she, popping pills and drinking because she did it on the night of the accident didn't mm -hmm. she now we were like oh maybe she heard about it blah 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 but maybe she thinks mama was banging that shit because papa was beating her Maybe. I understand it from a character beat as well. She's always kind of held up her dad as this like hero figure and now oh he wasn't so perfect. I get that, but it comes a point where you gotta have a sit down and you gotta have a chat because she's going off the rails. Mm. But towards it when she was at the school. It's just being awful. Yeah. And it's interesting that girl the girlfriend had maybe that's her voodoo powers that she was able to push her out of her head. See, that's interesting now where that's gonna kind of work out. Like, um, because and like a dummy didn't show us after her. Because they're talking about them to saving the world from this big thing that's gonna come. Roxon's doing something, digging for that stuff, and it's gonna destroy the city. And they're like, they yeah. can stop it, but they're kind of treating them like villains. Which which is kind of interesting, like the the but both of it, like I don't know what our, our opinion of Ty is, but when referencing obviously they don't know, but Dagger, 
they're kind of a little apprehensive about her and I don't know what that's about um, I've enjoyed the season so far and I'm obviously the cliffhangers mum has got a gun to her head is on the run that's nice we'll see what happened obviously you have the policeman's girlfriend she, she's acting out a little bit is them I think they're hinting at her being a villain I know she might be that way. In, I don't know. They said they said creating the villain as something in the voiceover of that Toby Priest, didn't they? Yeah, and I'm I think she might be a villain in the comic books. I have no idea. But it's kind of n not here nor there, depending on what they're going to do yeah. with her. You know, it's Killer Frost is a villain in the comic books, though, isn't she? That didn't really work out. Yeah, so I wonder, you know, whether because she's featured in it. You know, quite prominently out out of you know, apart from like the parent, she's probably like and that police guy with the scar. No, she's... she she's the most prominent character besides them two. Mm. So I mean, it looks like they're trying to do something with her. Let's talk numbers before we wrap it up. Eight. I'll give it a seven five. Okay. I'm Sam. I'm Matt. We'll see you next time on the Hub. Holla.